I was some sweet play in there, Brad. Well, you you laid the foundation. <laughs> How you doing? I'm good, man. Hit me, bump Dude, me. Woo! It is good to be back at the mothership. Man, more it is music been a in Evansville, Indiana. Here we long are. Long summer. <laughs> <laughs> Jeez. Oh, we've been to Fender. Been to PRS twice. And it's just been, I mean, it's been great. Like yeah. guitars, guitars, guitars all summer. But it's yeah. been like, I miss the family here, The hard man. work you're putting in now is going to mean some sweet guitars coming in soon. Yeah, yeah. And it, I'm, I'm like, I'm, you know, I'm, I'm worn out. Like, it's like, just, I'm tired of being away. Yeah. But, it's, but it's been good. I mean, it's all positive yeah. stuff, you know, so. Well, we're glad to have you back. I'm very glad to be back. Yeah. Hel hello, everyone. How's everybody? I'm Rob. <laughs> this is Brett. If you don't remember me, I'm part of this place. <laughs> more music, Evansville, Indiana, moreguitars.com. And we got a couple of special guitars here today to talk Very about. Special. What do you what do you, you wanna you wanna announce what we have here? So whilst on one of my trips, I get an email <laughs> from Erica Moore and Andy Yost from the Breed Love family, and they say, Hey, we're doing a limited run of Oregon guitars, and they are picked from a, an amazing flitch of guitar of tops and backs so yeah <laughs> so yeah i learned that at another factory and uh and but it's these are so this is a limited run called the eclipse burst yeah in the oregon guitar in line. one of our, our one of our favorite guitars here at the shop the yes. uh breed love oregon <clears throat> concert cutaway yes and it's got obviously so so what it is is you know oregon's a hard place to get to from evansville i've been there a bunch of times <laughs> And it's like, okay, I gotta fly from. It's not fly a direct from, thing, right? Yeah, exactly. You gotta fly from Evansville to like Dallas or Charlotte, and Charlotte to like Phoenix or wherever out there, somewhere sorta of going in that direction. And then you gotta go into like Portland and then into Redmond. So it's minimum three stops. You have to hike. Is there any? Uh, is there a hike involved in any part of this? Or well, there... eventually, yes. <laughs> but <laughs> you would think that'd be part of it, but. But it's hard to get there. So, yeah, yeah. Well, <laughs> so I refuse to go there in the cold anymore, yeah. man. I got stuck in Chicago on the way back, and it it sucked. I was there overnight. I'm, I I don't like staying in an airport overnight. No. But anyway, so they realize there's a problem. They can't get the dealers out there as much as like we can go to other factories and things. So what they do is they include us distinctive dealers mm -hmm. in an email. And they send a bunch of pictures of a bunch of guitars, and it's kind of first come, first serve. Well, I got, I think, to what are the best five or six, whatever we have in Out stock. of only 20, these are 25, 25 in this run? 25, and yeah. that is, this is a limited run. Now, that's not to say they might not do it again in a couple years, but this is the 2019 version of an Eclipse Burst, Myrtlewood, Myrtlewood, all the cool stuff that comes with an Oregon guitar. The Myrtle so. Wood on these guitars too has got some really cool figuring in it. It's like it almost looks like flame maple. Yeah, yeah, a koa a little bit. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. That kind of like I call them stretch marks. It looks like. You know what I mean? But <laughs> easy, uh, easy. <laughs> I've got a few of those. But anyway, so like, you know, the figuring on the back of this guitar. You know, they, so they send a picture of the front and the back. We know what these are going to sound like because they're Myrtle Wood, Myrtle Wood. We've got a bunch of them. Yeah. But the cool thing is, is like, the top and the back are from the same flitch. That's cool. So it's like you kind of got. It's like you know, like, like a lot of times you buy an electric guitar and you get this amazing quilt top or flame maple top or whatever. Mm -hmm. And the only people that ever, you either get to see it while it's sitting there on your stand in your mm -hmm. house yeah. or the crowd gets to see it. Mm -hmm. Well, like you can do this and just say, hey, I got a cool guitar. The top looks like it's For a everyone's enjoyment. Yes, including mine. One thing that I just realized that I didn't know, that I, that I just did not pay you attention to. didn't know that you to, didn't know? Is like the fade on the I neck. I was just I, I was withholding my comment because I just I'm like how cool is that that they faded the satin uh, neck on that. Yeah, thing. I mean, look, it's upside down. It's right side up. It fades either way. <laughs> so if you like it one way or the other, you can do it either way, and you know. Yeah. But uh, but anyway, so to get to the nuts and bolts of the guitar, 
it is myrtle wood. The whole body's made of myrtle wood. So myrtle wood top, myrtle wood sides, myrtle wood back. All solid construction. All solid. And you can hear it. These get to, when I it's I was playing cannon. when you walked into the room and that these things are cannons. Yeah. And for being you know ne these are smaller body guitars and just your brain automatically wants to think okay smaller guitar smaller sound you can't pigeonhole this guitar like that because no. these things are amazing. That's one thing Breedlove's done that I think they've done better than anybody is take smaller body guitars and make them sound big. Well, I think it has everything to do with the sound optimization that they do. Yeah. Um, with yeah. they, I've said this before, and they seem to maximize every guitar's potential that they build because of how they're matching uh, tops to backs to and weights, weights and thicknesses you know yeah. like this guitar has to be within you know it's crazy how they yeah, do it i yeah. wish i wish we could give a really good demonstration of that but yeah um they're doing some unique stuff out there in uh bend oregon bend that bend uh, the rules. that is that is they're making some killer guitars well and i think you know like this the, this body style has been the flagship for breed love since the beginning i mean even the concert cm mm -hmm. is a concert body guitar with a funky cutout yeah, right, you know and a funky right. you know upper bout yeah um but it's a concert size guitar so they've they've really seen in the past especially the last five or six years the importance to make this guitar sound amazing yeah and they've done it. So now that they've got this, it's kind of like Taylor with the V-Brace. It's kind of like they got this foundation that they can build all these amazing guitars mm -hmm. on. I mean, it's the sound optimization is, is, is equally as impressive as anything that anybody's coming out yeah. with right now. Yeah. You just don't hear about it as much because Breedlove's not that as well known as a brand. Yeah, you know, but you you got to look into it. It's it's a legitimate. So we're shouting from the rooftops. Mm. Breed love, yes. sound optimization. Breed love, <laughs> but yes, but it is. I mean, it's a it's an amazing thing. I mean, it, yeah. it really is, and they're doing it on every guitar. I mean, like they're putting, even if they're not doing it on the import stuff, they're using the knowledge and the technology to make it work for those. So like. You're talking about it's a trickle down thing. They yeah. do it for the American made stuff in Bend and they let it and they use as much of it as they possibly can to make the, all their guitars. Yeah. I mean, we're talking so, like the pursuits and yeah, discoveries. Discoveries, so that, everything. That, that knowledge that they yeah. gain trickles down, absolutely. I literally play a Breed Love concertina every night. Really? That's my that's my sit on the couch and play guitar every night and it's a discovery. Two hundred ninety nine dollar non electric straight up concert maybe it's three ninety nine either way it's extremely inexpensive and I play it every night because mm -hmm. it's a joy yeah. I love it so anyway we we got on the nuts and bolts and we forgot about it so mahogany top and back and sides no not mahogany oh, no, Jesus Myrtlewood yes wrong M so and then it's a uh, you were Eastern, just testing me, weren't you? I was. Are you still awake? <laughs> I know. I went off on a tangent. I'm making sure you, you still... You wanted to see if I'd agree with you. Yes. Yeah. So, Eastern Hard Rock Maple, which is on most of their guitars, and this is an amazing feeling. With a neck. satin finish, so it never gets sticky. It's always nice and smooth. It's fast. It's fast, I tell you. <laughs> just like... Uh, when you just play like it up Andy, or down, just either like way. Andy Timmons, you know, it just sounds <laughs> just like them, you know, any yeah. of those guys, you know. Right. Just, I just, I, it makes me shred just like them. And you know, Santiago, a good friend of my ours mm -hmm. and the friend of the store, is at that Steve Vai thing this week. He went and did the Steve Vai camp. So like, he's so doing it. So we expect him to come back shredding. Sh shredding. Yes, he yeah. should be. Santiago, you better be shredding. So anyway, so. Enough of that. So African Ebony for the fretboard and African Ebony for this Delta Bridge, which is, you know, the Ebony's killer. It's awesome. It's amazing for sound. It's amazing for feel. The electro awesome. We haven't even talked about the electronics really yet. I mean, this has got the uh, LR bags system in it with the little stealthy controls right here. Element active system. Volume and tone control. Sounds great plugged in. It does. It sounds real true to the guitar. Yeah. Yeah, I dig it, man. I yeah. have no problem recommending these guitars. I, I think everybody should go out and get, well, at least the first twenty-five people should go out and get. Yeah, one. or the first five or six. Yeah, should at get least them from get us. them from us. Yeah, then whatever. Yeah, but uh, <laughs> but so 
Breedlove tuners, they're crazy awesome. Yeah. This guitar was tuned, not in tune, because when we take pictures, we straighten them all up to make them look pretty for you. Tuned it up. We played for about 30 minutes leading up to this, and they stayed in tune the whole time. Yeah. So, but, you know, what makes this guitar special is, you know, other uh, on top of, like, all the other organs, yeah. is that it's an Eclipse Burst. So it's got, you know... And this, this is stuff that I never paid attention to until we really got into getting all these cool guitars several years ago. And it's like the, the, where they decide to put bursty type things, you know, mm -hmm. the back is, it's like what I would almost call like a micro burst. It's just a real classy, small burst. Mm -hmm. The neck, I mean, it's just cool. And I, I actually got a video of me, there's another burst right there. I know. Or fade, whatever you it's want to call it. It's very bursty. It's bursty in very subtle places. But anyway, I got to go actually in the spray booth with one of the employees and watch them spray. I th Maybe it was a prairie, no, it was longer ago Did you have to that. wear the hazmat suit? I did, man. I had the white thing on, the mask, and it was cool. Cool. But just to watch, you know, it's not a, it's not a computer. It's not a, it's not a machine that's painting it's these some things. some dude that like, has mastered the craft of bursting. He does this, and he makes <laughs> makes things happen. Just all day long, even yes. when he's not spraying. Right, yeah, he's just, <laughs> he just like it. he's at a <laughs> fish concert or something. It's like he's conducting an orchestra. <laughs> <laughs> you know, <laughs> but, you know, but it's amazing to see people, you know, there's two guys, and I, the problem is, is I have the worst memory in the world, but I talk to these two guys in the finish department every time I go there. Yeah. I hang out with them for a good 20, 30 minutes, and it's so much fun. They talk about how thin the coatings are on this thing, on these guitars, mm -hmm. so they're, it, it just does not dampen the tone. doesn't choke. Tone. Yeah. Yeah. But it's killer. So, I mean, simple, you know, herringbone, uh, purfling, and rosette. Mm -hmm. Very classy, straight up guitar, amazing, amazing guitar for the money. I mean, ridiculous. I don't even know what it costs, but I know it's. I know it's. We should like even tell people like which. Uh, what's the last three digits? Zero of the zero zero. You have zero zero zero. Okay. I think uh, this is number. I have one. nine eight five. So if you want any one of these two, the twenty four nine eight five. Two four nine eight five. Okay, so this is twenty five thousand. Wow. So this is a very special guitar. This is the twenty fifth, twenty five, twenty five thousandth, get serialized American made guitar that Breedlove made. I think oh. is what that would mean. Okay, cool. Isn't that something? Yeah. I may be wrong on that. But it's something. It. I don't know what, but it's something. <laughs> Something. <laughs> okay, so let's uh, let's uh, let's wrap it up. All right. So more guitars. I forgot all of that. What we do here. <laughs> you did. We sell guitars, <laughs> but we also provide amazing customer service. That's what separates us from everybody else out there. It's it's us. It's us. Yeah. It's our customer service. It's you know. It's not you see us on the video and then it's some other guys back in the back somewhere picking up the phone and, and setting up your guitars. It's us. Yeah, yeah. We're literally, the, literally. <laughs> I set up nine guitars last Monday. And yeah. it's, you know, like, and that's, that's what I love doing. I answer that's the, the phones. Thing. I'm the guy half the time. You know, if, yeah. you, if you live chat on the website, you're talking to me, you're talking to Brett. It's, it's us. Yeah. And, so 30-day uh, return policy, yeah. but if you return it within 48 hours, you get all your money back. Shipping to you, from you, all that money comes and back to you. And that's not 48 hours from when you click the button. It's from when you receive the guitar. So you've yeah. got two full days once you get the guitar to, to make sure it's a perfect fit. For Play you. it in your bedroom. You know, if it's an electric guitar, you plug it into your rig. You make sure it sounds right on your rig. You're not walking into a store and playing it through a bunch of stuff that they have pre-set up. Mm -hmm. You get to play it. Um, you know, we have ridiculous f amounts of financing options, and we're getting ready to add one or two more, I believe. Perhaps, perhaps. Uh, yeah. If I can talk Rob into doing it. Um, but we triple mm -hmm. inspect. So a lot of people say 100,000 point inspection, 50 point inspection. We check all that stuff. It's, it's, that's old hat. We have three people look at this thing. Yeah. We get it out of the box. Somebody checks the aesthetics of it, make sure it plays you know, Under some pretty work. seriously harsh light, too. I mean, yeah, yeah. Not, not these lights. This FBI, is FBI interrogation exactly. quality. Yes. 
So we do that, triple inspect, three people get their eyes on it. It goes back in the box that the Breed Love shipped it to us all the way across the United States, so it's going to be safe as long as the shipping companies don't do anything silly, you know. Um, but anyway, all those things are amazing things that we're here for you. So enough on us. Let's We've said a here. lot. The, the, yes. the, the, the takeaways are awesome guitar, awesome shop, awesome people, awesome customers. We want you 110% happy with your purchase, and we will do whatever it takes to make sure that happens. Do this. More music, Evansville, Indiana, moreguitars.com. Thanks Call, for joining us. Chat, email, all that. We're here. We're here.